Hi, this is Jeremy from Duster 3D. Duster 3D is a free open source 3D modeling software for quick making game assets with texture and rig automatically generated. It supports Linux, macOS, and Windows. I usually post one video to show the progress of the development on this tiny software and share some news related. Last week, I was too busy on preparing a big release, Beta 22, which including a procedure generation feature. Please check the download link in the description. So last week, I didn't post a devlog. Okay, what happened during the last two weeks? First, we have a new logo. I advertised a freelance logo design job on Twitter and got many responses, but I have to choose only one to work on the logo design. Thanks to all the talented designers and artists who have contacted me. The logo was designed by Corner Branding. Please check the link in the description if you like the design. Contact him for your logo design. Please note that is a paid job. Next. Test 3D now supports procedure generation using JavaScript. I have made a blog post to get you quick started. Please check the link in the description. Basically, it works in the same way as web browser, pass JavaScript to, to create HTML document. To make 3D math easy, I have introduced the Web3 and the container from 3.js. Please try it if you know JavaScript and don't forget to share your screenshot to our form. Next. Now, Phillips reported a UI scanning issue. Thanks now. The UI definitely needs some reworks, but it may be delayed a little bit. If you have any suggestions on the improvement of the UI, please leave a comment below. Next, Josh Stanhol reported a default button issue on the alert message box. Thanks Josh, good catch. I guess it may be a QT library bug, because the default button should be no if not specified but I have fixed it on the application code to explicitly specify the no as a default button. Next, Torchwords suggested snap to grid feature. He even did a draft design for this new feature. It's very helpful to make the idea clear and I can't appreciate it more. Torchwords is very supportive on Duster 3D and he's a great contributor to this tiny community. There are many useful features are being suggested by him, such as the flat shading mode and only skin in the motion editor Please follow him on Twitter, link in the description. Next, thanks to Christoph Nefbriver, Duster 3D have a chocolatey package. That means you can install Duster 3D on Windows command line. If you are a Linux user and get used to YUM, that's what you need to get used to Windows. It's a YUM alternative on Windows. Please check the official chocolate logic and uh, Christoph's uh, Twitter account for more information. Link in the description. As you may know, I have been doing the 10 minutes every day for more than 100 days. Every day I post one model on Twitter. Yesterday I received a comment from Dethink Studios. He asked if Duster 3D can make a lawn chair. Of course, so I asked him to drop me a reference image. And I made this model as today's 10 minutes every day. The actual modeling time is about 20 minutes on this model. Dethink Studio tweet link in the description. Please enjoy the full progress of the launch chair modeling and don't forget to subscribe and the like button. Thank you all and see you next time.